China's Wing Lung X drone, showcasing its full anti-submarine capabilities for the first time, is on exhibit at the ongoing airshow China 2024 in Zhuhai, South China's Guangdong province. The drone has begun routine test flights. Built with fully independent intellectual property, the Wing Lung X drone is a medium-altitude long-endurance unmanned aerial system with long-range, heavy payload capacity, and the ability to perform multiple tasks. Military enthusiasts will monitor the latest advances in the capabilities of the People's Liberation Army Air Force, while foreign businesses hope to make deals with their Chinese counterparts. As reported by Global Times on November 13, 2024, the Aviation Industry Corporation of China officially introduced the Wing Lung X UAV at the 15th China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition in Zhuhai. The Wing Lung X is a medium-altitude, long-endurance unmanned aerial vehicle designed for multi-role functionality, including maritime escort, anti-submarine warfare, air close support, anti-radiation strikes, low-altitude alert and interception, and maritime search and rescue. Built to address combat needs in long-range scenarios, this UAV provides a range of capabilities aimed at operating across various combat environments and domains. The Wing Lung X UAV is structured for a heavy payload and long-range operation, and it integrates features and technology developed from the existing Wing Lung series. The aircraft has undergone regular test flights and inherits prior operational experience while incorporating recent technological advancements in UAV systems. The design of the Wing Lung X reflects an effort to address customer demands for multitasking UAV platforms with independent intellectual property rights. Currently in the test flight phase, the UAV combines reconnaissance and strike capabilities, as well as cross-domain coordination and emergency response functions. A highlight of the Wing Lung X's introduction at the airshow was the public debut of its anti-submarine warfare configuration. This variant is equipped with specialized payloads, including sonar buoy pods, torpedoes, air-to-air -air missiles, and air-to-ship missiles, allowing it to conduct anti-submarine missions and secure specific maritime areas. According to Tang Yong, the UAV's chief designer, the anti-submarine variant can perform essential tasks for area control such as wide-area maritime reconnaissance, submarine search and attack, long-range patrols, and integration into coordinated system operations. Tang explained that this configuration's anti-submarine patrols allow for coverage and surveillance of critical areas, enhancing systemized marine security and operations. At the airshow, AVIC displayed the UAV's capability for various combat operations beyond anti-submarine missions. The Wing Lung X can perform full domain reconnaissance and strike, operate in electronic reconnaissance and interference roles, relay communications, and provide support in both maritime and land scenarios. The UAV is equipped with different payloads, including torpedoes, electronic warfare pods, and several missile types, allowing for versatile mission configurations. Specific weapons compatible with the Wing Lung X include the LD-8A anti-radiation missile, PL-12 and PL-10 air-to-air -air missiles, YJ-9 and CM-400 AKG anti-ship missiles, and LS-6 250kg and 500kg guided bombs. Additionally, it can support jamming tasks through payloads like the CRJP jamming pod. In the anti-submarine role, the UAV configuration includes payloads for sonar buoy deployment, radar pods for detection, and ET-60 electric anti-submarine torpedoes. These tools allow the Wing Lung X to conduct missions such as maritime patrols, wide area surveillance, and submarine engagement, offering extended flight time to support continuous operations in expansive maritime zones. Tang Yong also noted that the Wing Lung X's endurance provides added value for long-duration operations, contributing to the formation of an anti-submarine network that can effectively cover large areas and coordinate with other UAVs and manned systems to address submarine threats. At this exhibition, the Wing Lung X UAV and over 20 other AVIC developed UAVs, including those in the Wing Lung and Cloud Shadow series, were displayed collectively. The AVIC aims for the Wing Lung X to fill roles in cross-domain support, combat adaptability in counter-environment scenarios, and emergency rescue operations. This airshow appearance marks a significant point in the testing and demonstration phase of the Wing Lung X UAV highlighting its full integration of operational capacities for various defense scenarios.
Given that the first two variants Wing Long 1 and Wing Long 2 are already in active production and service, it's unsurprising that this could indeed be the much-anticipated Wing Long 3. International Defense Analysis recently posted the test flight footage on their X account. With a caption noting, The Wing Long X high-altitude long-endurance UAV test footage has just dropped and emphasizing the distinct yellow hues of the drone. Upon closer inspection of the footage, several design features stand out. Notably, the drone's wings appear to have an extensive wingspan, positioned high on the fuselage. This elevated wing placement is a hallmark of high-altitude long-endurance UAVs. As it promotes better aerodynamic stability, particularly for high-altitude flights and operations in challenging weather conditions. The placement minimizes the impact of turbulence on the main body, offering more precise control while reducing aerodynamic drag. Such design elements are crucial when considering the drone's primary role, long-duration missions. Wing Lung 3's wing structure is optimally engineered to excel in both high-altitude, low-speed scenarios and higher speed flight, with minimal drag. The smooth, oval contours of the wings contribute to both stability and energy efficiency, allowing the UAV to achieve longer endurance while consuming less fuel. Another key feature of the Wing Lung 3 is its adaptability. The wings facilitate stable flight not only in a horizontal position, but also during maneuvers at medium to high altitudes. The higher placement of the wings also aids in faster climbs and mitigates the effects of thermal air currents that could otherwise destabilize the drone's flight path. The prototype seen in the footage also includes a distinctive V-tail, a feature that first appeared on the Wing Lung 2. This V-shaped tail is designed to enhance stability and control, especially during extended, high-efficiency flights. The primary advantage of the V-tail, which combines the functions of both a horizontal and vertical stabilizer, is a reduction in the overall number of components at the rear of the UAV. This results in a lighter, more compact structure. The V-tail design is particularly advantageous when it comes to maneuverability. UAVs like the Wing Lung 3, which are tasked with executing precise movements in confined spaces or adjusting quickly to rapidly changing combat conditions, benefit greatly from this type of tail. It also enhances the UAV's overall stability during long-duration missions at high altitudes or in unpredictable weather. There are also noticeable bulges beneath the wings of the Wing Lung 3, which likely serve as mounting points for additional equipment or weapons systems. If these bulges are indeed intended for armament, they suggest the possibility of integrating various munitions such as guided missiles, bombs, or precision-guided weapons, turning the Wing Lung 3 into a formidable asset for both surveillance and strike missions. However, it's also possible that these bulges are not solely for weapons, but serve to house additional sensors or electronic systems for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance purposes. These pods are commonly used to mount a range of optical, infrared, and radar sensors, enabling the drone to perform complex missions like monitoring, reconnaissance, and mapping over extended periods.